All right, moving on to question 12. It says, David goes into a candy store with five bucks. He buys nine peppermints for 15 cents each and some sour candies. Uh, it doesn't tell us how many sour candies he buys. It says each sour candy costs 25 cents. Enter the maximum number of sour candies David can buy. All right, so we know he starts off with $5. So he starts off with five bucks. And we also know that he buys nine peppermint candies for 15 cents each. So he buys nine peppermint candies for 15 cents. So that means he spends a total of, let's see, nine times five is 45. One times nine is nine, plus four is 13. So it's 135, but my question has the decimal moved two times to the left. So my, my decimal here has to be moved two times to the left. All right, so he starts off with five bucks. He spends a dollar twenty-five on these peppermint candies, and so he's left with. Let's see. If we go ahead and subtract, we're left with three dollars and sixty-five cents. So we know that David has three dollars and sixty-five cents to spend on sour candy. So how many can he buy? Well, I can make a little table here on the right. I can say these are the amount of candies that David buys. So these are the amount of sour candies. And then the cost associated with it. So for example, we know that uh, one sour candy is gonna cost 25 cents. Uh, we know two candies, well that's just going to be 50 cents. Three candies is going to be 75 cents. And then four candies is going to be a dollar. And so we know four candies is going to be a dollar. So that means if I buy another four candies, so if I buy now eight candies, that should be another dollar, which is two dollars. And similarly, if I buy another candy, another four candies, I'm going to have 12 which is gonna be $3. Remember that David has $3.65 left to buy sour candies, so he can still buy more than 12, because 12 is only $3, so he can keep going. If he buys 14, that's gonna be $3.50, and then finally, um, 15 candies would cost $3.75, which would be too much, because he only has $3.65. So in this case, the most amount of candies you can buy is three, uh, 14. And so right here, the answer is 14. Oops, 14. And if I check my answer key, uh, yep, the answer is 14. So it matches up. All right, hope that makes sense.